It's another day, a blessed way to say welcome. I'm glad, I'm indeed glad to be here this afternoon. I'm all grateful because I have life that morning can I buy. In spite of the bad voice, God has given me the strength to be here to do what I'm called to do and doing it to the best of my ability. Is what I pledge my loyalty to. And I'm going to do all I can through the help of God to do it. Uh, to see my nation among the communities of nations. So we say we all have different strength and weaknesses. So it behooves us to respect each other's differences. Everyone is special in their own ways. You never know what tomorrow will bring. So I want to say to you folks, if you stand for a reason, be prepared to stand like a tree. If you fall onto the ground, fall like a sea that grows back to fight again. This is the program Super Drive Time on Super 95.5. Monday through Friday we're here talking issues of the traffic and chipping through the national issues and issues that concern the livelihood of our people. Like we often say, the motherland will never fall. Borrowing from one of our, our fallen journalists in person of the late Mama D. Jackete. So I'm here this afternoon just to give you a word of what we're going to be doing on the program. And after this intro, what we're going to do here is to provide you some uh, motivational messages. Following our motivation, uh, we're going to afford you the opportunity uh, to get some insight of uh, the Human Rights Report on Liberia. Ranging from 2020, it's actually disheartening. That report is not welcoming at all. It's not in good fit for our country. As we all know, this is the same path that past administrations tread on that led to so many things. So the question is, should we tread on the same path and allow ourselves to be taken to places that we shouldn't go after our leadership? So we want to say to the ruling establishment, no matter what it is, no matter how you see the report, we all should take caution. It should serve as a means of caution for us to do the right thing and to enforce the rule of law so that we exonerate ourselves from claims and counterclaims. And on the flip side, 5 o'clock, we'll be playing host to a daughter of the soil, someone who actually went way well before, but realized that the life she lived back in the days wasn't the right path for her. Through the help of others, she has regained her sanity and is involved with music and other activities. She's no other than Pizzo, Lady Pizzo. The most talk about Lady Pizzo that you know will be talking with her on the flip side at 5 o'clock. And hopefully we're going to be chipping in with uh, some information from the water and sewer. So all these package on today's presentation of the program Super Drive Time. My name is Rufus Divine Cannon. Some say the irreplaceable D, while others say the humble pleaser. Whatever it is, one individual, several names. But I'm mommy last born. I'm grateful to be here this afternoon. Welcome to the program Super Drive Time on Super 9 to 5.5.
it's good to be back let's get started it's great to be back with the time 11 meetings down for it's time that we talk the talk and walk the walk and do those things that are meant to be done let's say hats off to you joining us as always on our live feed as you eyes in year by uh, thank you so much for joining us from Monrovia. We appreciate your time and all others listening to us via Super FM and uh, following via Super TV Live. You leave your comments. We will read them out on the program this afternoon. We start up on this week talking about putting in time, doing those things, uh, getting to know who we befriend, those who we call our friends, and uh, most of all, the best of it all, is to actually recalibrate and uh, re-energize ourselves and look around us, look into our cycle, inner cycles, those who are for and those who are against. Distance yourself from people that are not like-minded because when they cannot bring out the best in you, they will do all they can to bring the worst out in you. So it's good that you bring out the best out in each other. So you befriend people of like minds, people that will look at positive things, people that will look you in the face when you go wrong and tell you, hey, dude, you are wrong. People that will look you in the face and say, hey, look, this is the path you should take that will you to positive results and not to heal you when you do the wrong thing, heal you when you do the right thing, heal you when you do the worst thing. Those are not friends. So look into your inner cycle. Those you call your friends, examine them and uh, recalibrate and move ahead. If those people are not making uh, those positive changes that should be made in your life, disassociate yourself. Like I told you on yesterday, it is by mandate we are to love each other. For some of us who are Christians, it is stated in the Bible that uh, the old man taught us that we should love one another. Hmm? But mind you, he also gave us the leverage to choose people we call friends. Because as the other or the saying goes, show me your friend and I will tell you who you are, breasts of the same fellow flocks together. And we should also come to think about this, that the attitude or the, um, how you call it, the attribute of the person that you are associated with also reflects on you because they are like a mirror so everything that that person does it sends a signal and uh, reflects on you as an individual so sometimes you say oh and i may get smoke but i guess smoke but we're moving together come on you may not smoke but guess what the chances of you smoking is as 50 50. if you cannot change that man or that woman she's bound to change you or he's bound to change you so you must build up that sense of reasoning to understand that in as much you are not capacitated to change that person give a u-turn get people around you of like minds people that will bring out the best out in you if that friend is always taking you to the club is that friend is always taking you to to, to 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 do things that are not called for get to understand that you need to disassociate yourself it's not something that you're going to cut a speech no but those inner things that you had with them those uh, deeper conversation that you have with them, the movement that you have, you're going to limit those movement. Speech is often that you speak to the person. It's always good to speak. It's always good to associate. But mind you, there must be a limitation between you. If you're used to do things in common, get to know that you are on a next level. So you got to limit those conversations that you had before that blow your mind off to do those negative things. You have to disassociate yourself from things that the both of you uh, equally did. Because, mind you, that person is serving as a mirror that reflects on your attitude. So let's go to that path. On yesterday, um, it was interesting to know that we receive, right? Um, before we go to that, let's get um, some bit up of the traffic. On yesterday, the traffic was kind of jammed in a Congo town area. Precisely the, the um, Tottenham Boulevard and Congo Town Bagway intersection, where uh, a truck ran into a motorcycle, leaving the two individuals seriously wounded. But by the grace of God, um, with information we've gathered from the hospital, uh, they are coping well and are doing fine. So thank God that they did not actually lose their life to the accident. Uh, the driver of that. Um, a sanitation truck 
has come to the scene after the incident. Uh, so uh, police, the car is now in police custody and our uh, investigation is about to start or have started already. So we move on. Yesterday we were privileged to have received um, a Demin report, human rights report. Oh yes, that human rights report is troubling. Let me say it for the record, it's troubling. It's nothing about politicking. It's nothing about us, oh, this position, no position, in position, opposition, no. Let, let's not look at it in that direction because, mind you, this report also highlights those that are even in the opposition of things that they did in the time past. It's about human rights, violation. So we're going to chip through and uh, read you some of uh, the... Um, the lines within the report we're going to chip through but before that uh with this information just filtering from uh plebo southern district maryland county uh the speaker of the house of representative resident is being set ablaze in plebo city maryland county with footage coming from uh, plebo southern district maryland county we say thanks to emmanuel shaw who provided us this uh, footage on Facebook. You see the uh, green, that's lemon green uh, building of uh, the house speaker, Buffer Chimers. Uh, seeing the fence also lemon green and black. Uh, it's actually set ablaze in Plebo, Silicon District, Maryland County. So many thanks to Emmanuel Shaw for that um, information. He says, Speaker Chimers, resident set ablaze in Plebo, City Maryland County. Um, as you all know, a couple of days, um, there, there have been some uh, troubling information uh, from uh, Maryland County about the death of a motorcyclist. Uh, it's been alleged that uh, he was killed by ritualists, and uh, those citizens of Maryland County uh, took out to the streets and damaged uh, government property, the damage. Uh, the, 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 the praising and all the stuff like that. So these are things that we continue to raise as citizens. We shouldn't take the law into our own hands. Violence is not the way. We should do things that are meant to be done. We should address issues as they should. Mind you. So we always call on the um, justice system of our country those that are running the justice system of our country to be speedy in their proceedings so that people who go to them for a justice that justice can be served equally all right there should be no delay in dispensing justice so the delay and the politicking in the justice system will lead to these kind of things so we want to clearly and categorically say um, in this open manner that um, the report is damning. Actually, the report is not is not is not cool at all. The report is not cool at all. So we're gonna get this brief out. When we come back, we're gonna read you a portion uh, of the report. Actually, so let's get a song from my uh, lady Pizzo. Lady Pizzo, of course, um, she's out or something new. So we'll get Lady Pizzo's song while we uh, make this quick adjustment on the program this afternoon. Beatmaster exclusive. Sing it, people miss it, that was not for me I was 
for the next song we're gonna be talking to Lele Pisa at five so let's go through the uh, report I told you today is a uh, power pack presentation on this broadcast y'all leave me y'all leave me <laughs> Yeah. I'm on the air, I'm on the air, I'll talk to you later. A little pizza, you know, these things happen. These things happen actually uh, when you are on the air and you have information filtering and people calling here, there, and yana, so you get. Um, uh, <laughs> But however, we're going to be talking to Lady Pizza on the flip side, 5 o'clock. It's 23 minutes down 4. So let's go to the um, 2020 country report on human rights practices in Liberia. Uh, so we're going to read you bits and pieces of this um, information. We won't go in depth. We will go to the certain portion of it. And um, as time can permit us, we do what is meant to be done. All right. So the 2020 country report on human rights practices in Liberia, Bureau of Democracy, Human Rights and Labor, March 30, 2021. So we go to right, right here in session, executive summary uh, announcement. The Department of State will release an addendum to this report in May 2021 that expand the sub subsession of women in session 6 to include a uh, broader range of issues related to uh, reproductive rights. All right, Liberia is a constitutional republic with a bicameral national assembly and a democratically elected government. The country held presidential and legislative elections in 2017, which domestic and international observers deemed generally free and fair in december the country held midterm senatorial elections which observes observers deemed largely peaceful although there were some reported instances of vote tempering in teaming day
from uh, uh, the Demin report, Himarai report. So we had a technical uh, breakthrough, uh, which of course actually took us to um, leaving the live feed. But we're back actually, so we're going to go through it. Uh, it's 4.30, we're going to go through it uh, swiftly uh, for you. So in December, the country held midterm senatorial election, which observers deemed largely peaceful, although there were some reported instances of vote tampering, intimidation, harassment of female candidates, um, election violence, opposition candidates won 11 of the 15 Senate seats contested, according to election results announced by the National Elections Commission on December 21. The Liberal National Police uh, maintain internal security with assistance from the Liberia Drug Enforcement Agency and other civilian security forces. The armed forces of Liberia are responsible for external security but also has some domestic security responsibilities if called upon. The Liberia National Police and the Liberia Drug Enforcement Agency report to the Ministry of Justice while the Armed Forces of Liberia report to the Ministry of National Defense. Civilian authorities generally maintain effective control over the security forces. Members, members of the security forces committed some uh, abuses, it says. Significant human rights issues including or included arbitrary killing by police, cases of cruel, inhuman or degrading treatment or punishment by police, harsh and life-threatening pressing conditions, arbitrary detention by government officials, serious problems with the independence of the judiciary, serious a uh, restriction on freedom of the press, including violence and threats of violence against journalists, official corruption, lack of investigation and accountability for violence against women, the existence or use of law, criminalization, consensual same-sex sexual conduct, between adults and worst form of child labor, impunity for individuals who committed human rights abuses, including atrocities during the Liberian civil wars that ended in 2003. Remain, it says, remain a serious problem, although the government cooperated with war crimes investigators in third countries that government made intimate but limited attempt to investigate the prosecute officials accused of current abuses whether in the security forces or as well in the government session one respect for the integrity of the person including freedom from a arbitrary deprivation of life and order unlawful or political motivated killings. There were occasional reports that government or its agents committed arbitrary or unlawful killings. On January 26, bodyguards of President George Weah assaulted Zenon Kobwe Miller, a labor, it says a local broadcast journalists as he was leaving the Samuel Kyndo Sports Stadium in Monrovia on January 27. The case was highlighted in a statement by the Press Union of Liberia, the PUL, an independent organization for media professionals, and later by the Committee to Protect Journalists. Miller wrote in a Facebook post that he had seen a doctor and was suffering from pains in his legs and chest after the brutal attack. Mida filed a complaint with the PUL which met the, with police leadership on January 30 and called for a, trans, a transparent investigation. 
According to a PUL statement, Miller died in a local hospital on February 15 after complaining of numbness in his left arm and legs, according to local news reports. Why a direct link between the assault and death was never established since an autopsy was not conducted, the family issued a statement saying Miller had died of hypertension and stroke. On March 8, of off duty Liberia National Police LMP Sergeant Sensi Kowo, who was also the deputy commander of LMP Ganta City Detachment in Nimba County, allegedly flogged and choked 18 years old motorcyclist Samuel Silly after an argument. Silly died shortly thereafter. Authorities fired fire coal and opened an investigation into the death. One account of the event suggested Silly died as a result of stone thrown by friends who came to his defense. Sergeant Kowu, who originally filed or fled the scene, was arrested and charged with murder. At the first hearing of the 8th Judicial Sacred Court in San Nicol de Nima County during the August term of court, the former sergeant pled for a charge of Venus was granted and the case was pending transfer to Grand Bassa County at year's end. In June, the Civilian Complaint Review Board, an independent board mandated by law to investigate Police acts of violence against innocent persons began an investigation in circumstances that resulted in the death of the of a three-year-old child, Francis Mensa, in the township of West Point. The child died on April 20, reportedly as a result of an injury he sustained after six LMP officers allegedly kicked over a pot of hot water that fell on him. According to a press release issued by the Reveal Bowl Chairman, Councillor Tewan Gonglu, the officer were suspended and LMP investigation found the death was not caused intentionally, but some LMP officers involved received suspensions due to irregularities in reporting the event. There were no new developments in the June 2019 fatal shooting of 17-year-old Abraham Tume by police officer doing a protest demanding justice for the mysterious killing of two minors in May 2019. Four police officers were charged with neglect, negligence, homicide, and aggravated assaults and criminal facilitation in connection with Tomin's death. The officer allegedly fired live ammunition into the air in an attempt to disperse protesters, striking Tommy. The four officers were incarcerated at the Monrovia Central Prison awaiting trial. We move on to B, disappearance. There were no reports of disappearance by or on behalf of government authorities. C. Torture and other cruel, inhuman, or degrading treatment or punishment. The Constitution and law prohibits such practices. However, there were reports that government authorities allegedly abused, harassed, and intimidated persons in custody as well as those seeking protection. On April 23, Mohammed Kamara, a man reportedly suffering from mental illness, breached the perimeter of the president's private residence in Pinesville, outside Monrovia. LMP officers and agents of the Executive Protection Service kicked and used sticks to probe the individual while he lay prostrate. 
shirtless and handcuffed according to a widely circulated video of the incident. The office of the president announced the launch of an investigation into the case. Impunity was a problem in the security forces. Police and other security forces allegedly abused, harassed, and intimidated persons in police custody. As a result, it say as as well as those okay, as well as those seeking police protection, the printer called provides criminal penalties for excessive use of force by law enforcement officers and addresses permissible uses of forces during arrest or while preventing the escape of a prisoner from custody. An armed forces disciplinary board investigated alleged misconduct and abuses by military personnel. The armed forces administer non-judicial punishment as of August, the disciplinary bowl and three active cases in accordance with the memorandum of understanding between the Ministry of Justice and Defense. The armed forces referred capital cases to the civil court system for adjudication. So we move on gradually. Um, we will be taking Lady Pizzo at five, so we going through the human rights reports, and uh, we just on the first phase of it. So, pressing and pressing and detention center conditions, pressing and detention center uh, conditions, pressing conditions were at times harsh and life threatening due to food shortage. Gross overcrowding, inadequate sanitary conditions, and poor medical care. Physical condition, gross overcrowding continues to be a problem. The Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation reported that prison population in the country's 16 facilities was almost twice the planned capacity. Approximately one half of the country's 2,572 prisoners were at the Monrovia Central Prison, which was originally built for 374 detainees, but as of December held 1,230. The local non-governmental organization NGO Prison Fellowship Liberia reported that overcrowding in Block D of Monrovia Central Prison requires prisoners to sleep in sheds. The majority of juveniles were in pre-trial detention, pre-trial deten detainees and converted prisoners were held together. In some cases, men and women were held together and juveniles were held with adults. According to the Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation from January through September, there were 23 prison deaths in the country, including 13 deaths at the Monrovia Central Prison, 4 deaths each at the Ganta Central Prison and the Harper Central Prison, and 1 death each at the Tottenham Central Prison, the Tottenham Bird Central Prison, and the Bikana Central Prison. According to the Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation, none of the deaths in prison during the year resulted from prison violence or mistreatment of prisoners. The Bureau attributed the deaths to medical reasons other than COVID-19, including asthma, heart condition, and infection diseases. According to Prison Fellowship Liberia, however, Ministry of Health officials working in the prison did not test the bodies of deceased prisoners for signs of covid infection. Access to food and medical care was inadequate according to the UN standard minimum rules for the treatment of prisoners that every prisoner shall be provided by the prison administration at the usual hour with food of nutritional values adequate for health and strength of 
wholesome qualities and well prepared and served, but improved relative to the preceding year, Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation Administrators acknowledged interruption to the food supply during the year and blame poor road condition and delay budgetary allotments. Prison Fellowship Liberia reported personal diets overall remained poor even though rations had improved for the prior year. The Monrovia Central Prison sometimes served rice alone with prisoners purchasing oil from vendors at the prison to su supplement their diets. In some locations, prisoners supplemented their meal for purchasing food at prison or receiving food from visitors. Some prisoners grew their own rice and vegetables to su supplement food reactions. Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation officials reported six of the country's 16 prisons had medical clinics while the rest were visited by nurses. Nurses were scheduled to visit each of the prison without a medical clinic once or twice a week, but rarely adhered to the schedule, and facilities often went weeks without medical staff visit. The only location where medical staff was available Monday through Friday was the Monrovia Central Prison for approximately 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. The Ministry of Health and County Health teams have primarily responsibility a primary responsibility for the provision of medicine, but the supply chain was weak throughout the country, and prison medical staff often did not have access to necessary med medicine since replenishment sometimes took weeks of months. Inmates often went without medication for lengthy periods. A variety of NGOs including Serving Humanity for Empowerment and Development and the Rural Human Rights Activities Program provided some medication for detainees. Praising Fellowship Liberia noted that in some instances, family members were not notified when prisoners were seriously ill. There were reports of inadequate treatment for ailing inmates and inmates with disabilities. Authorities demanded whether to release or ill prison or an ill prisoner on an ad hoc basis and most were quarantined after presenting symptoms rather than being released. In June, the newspaper from Page Africa reported the Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation had implemented measures, including requiring hand washing and temperature checks of visitors to prevent the spread of COVID-19 to the prison population. In some locations, to provide court and medical escorts. This is a part of the report that we actually bring to you this afternoon. So conditions for female prisoners were somewhat better than for male. Female inmates were less likely to suffer from overcrowding and had more freedom to move within the women's session of facility. According to the Independent National Commission on Human Rights, the RNCHR, female detainees often lacked sanitary items unless provided by family. Occasionally, NGOs donated these items, but stocks ran out quickly. Administration The Bureau of Correction and Administration noted that correction of an investigative bowl at the Monrovia Central Prison to ensure reports of prisoners' misconducts were reviewed for appropriate administrative action. Independent monitoring. The government permitted independent monitoring of prison conditions by local human rights groups, international NGOs,
the United Nations diplomatic personnel and media. Some human rights groups, including domestic and international organizations, in including international organizations, visited detainees at police headquarters and prisoners in the Monrovia Central Prison. The INCHR and Prison Fellowship Liberia had unfettered access to facility. According to the Bureau of Correction the Rehabilit and Rehabilitation, the Liberian New Hope Foundation Center, serving humanity for empowerment and development, FIN, Church Aid. Serving Humanity for Development, UN Development Program, UNDP, and Rural Human Rights Activities also visited prisons during the year. Improvements. Early in the year, the government established the Human Rights in Prison Coordination Platform to ensure the human rights of inmates or prisons deprived of their liberty were protected. The coordination platform comprised representatives of the Protection Unit of the Ministry of Justice, Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation, Ministry of Health, donor partners and civil society organizations working on access to justice programs and on programs in education, agriculture and health. The platform acquired and distributed COVID-19 materials and medicine to prison through funding from the UNDP and two civil society organizations serving humanity for empowerment and dignity and rural human rights activate program. During the year, Bureau of Correction and Rehabilitation Administrator reported expanding a rehabilitation Oh my God, what's this coming? Let me get it quickly and then we conclude. And tomorrow we will start from where we will start today. Pressing Fellowship Liberia noted improvement in the provision of psychosocial counseling for prisoners and the treatment of prisoners by corrections officers. Psychosocial counseling was extended to 10 prisons according or across the country. So we're going to start to D. Arbitrary arrest or detention. Arbitrary arrest or detention. So with this damning uh, uh, information from the Human Rights Report. So tomorrow we will begin from D. The arbitrary arrest or detention. So with this little piece of information from the damning. We call it damning because it's troubling and it's not something to be taken lightly. We can recall these kind of reports came about during the administration of former president Charles Tiller. We Liberians play politics with it at the end of the day. It landed the former president behind bars today, and others are now facing justice for crimes of humanity and other issues. So if we, as a government and citizens of this country, where we continue to play politics with information from Uncle Sam, well, it's up to us. Because at the end of the day, Uncle Sam knows where, how, and when to get these individuals that they have earmarked. Mind you, it is not about politics. Those who we refer to as opposition, some of them are also recorded. Some of the, the mayhem and atrocity they have caused also recorded in this report. This report is so large. It is so large when you take your time to go through it. And if you need the report, you just highlight here and I'm going to provide a copy of the report to our followers. Okay? This report is troubling and we shouldn't take it lightly. We shouldn't take it as our normal politics. Because these are things that are actually permeating our society. And at the end of the day, mind you, man, Mr. President, former President Taylor, wasn't the one who implemented some of those crimes against humanity. It was people, it, it were actually people around him. 
And at the end of the day, he felt the brunt, or he's feeling the brunt of everything that actually took place during his administration. We do not want to see any of our leaders again going to prison or being behind bars for crimes against humanity or economic crimes. So this is about time with this kind of report, we need to recalibrate our moves as officials of government. We need to recalibrate our moves as security institutions because mind you, people are hiring every moves and shakings that you actually get involved with. I was listening to a tape and uh, somebody uh, spoke lengthily and this panelist rightly put it. He said Africans are being used by the Westerners to go against Africans. The Westerners will never come in your country to do things that they know within themselves that they cannot do. So what they do, they use people that are within to get at those people of like color, like creed. Hmm? So get to understand. All this information that been filtering around here, get to understand that these people follow up on this information given them by our own people too. And they themselves, they go and verify this information as well. So, okay, say you say the person here is corrupt. Okay, we will keep a watch on the person. And for sure, when the people keep a watch, they see you doing the same thing. So, the Westerners will never come against you by themselves. They will use your own people to get you. Here we are today. The issue of Gaddafi. It wasn't the Westerners that actually got at Gaddafi. It was the same people of Libya that rose out against Gaddafi. And at the end of the day, the Westerners succeeded by getting Gaddafi down through the help of the same people of Libya. So it's just a listener test. It's just a, a, a man tricking things for us. If we are to move ahead as a nation, if we are to move ahead as a continent, there are a lot of things we need to put in place. We start this far, and coming up, we'll be talking to Lele Piso. Of course, the song you got in the background earlier on is done by this sister. I must tell you for free. We've been told from our childhood days up to present that the other mind is the devil's workshop. And as such, when the minds are idle, you understand that anything trickles. It's being accepted by the idle mind because you want to keep the mind busy. So any negative thing pass their way, they're going to get hold of it and see it as good. So if the environment is not created adequately for our people, our kids, the ones who we refer to as future leaders, to take on the helm of power in time to come, what we refer to them as future leaders when the future comes, what are they to do? Are they prepared? Are we preparing them now for the future? So most of our friends, most of our young friends are found in the ghettos. They have turned out to be wayworlds. They are not willing to be there. It is not their pleasure to be there, but because of certain reasons. Some may be taken from the interior on the 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 the, the, the the guy, uh, these guys that all oh, they are bringing the kids to Monrovia for education, and when the kids come to this town, they've been maltreated, they've been humiliated. At the end of the day, they find themselves mingling with bad friends, and these friends take them to these ghettos. They start to do unwholesome things. At the end of the day, they pay off to be crime or criminals. So we are so privileged and we are so delightful that our sister who went down for so many months even years realized that indeed that era wasn't hers so she thought otherwise with the talent that god had imposed in her to come back to give back to society in spite of her condition she still needs help it is not over yet. She still needs help. So if you're following us via Super TV Live, 
you following us via Super FM. Lena Pizzo is in the studio. Shatta will be talking with her. But listen to a piece from her and listen well. She needs your support at all costs. We need to keep her brainy. We need to keep her doing those positive things that she yearn for. Second time around, Lele Pizzo. Let me not, let me not jump. You will get more of Lady Pizzo, but I'm privileged at this time to have this daughter of the soil, this talented daughter of the soil in the studio with me to talk about her career, to talk about things that she's involved with, to talk about a lot of things that are actually going on in her life. 
And um, she's also here with a manager, but we're gonna start up with our Lady Pizzo. Lady Pizzo, how you doing, my sister? Oh, I'm grateful to God. I bless God so much for my life, for where He took me from, where He brought me in, and where He's taking me. And I'm so overwhelmed. I'm blessed, God. I'm, you know, God is good. Honestly, He's fed. He's great. He's the reason we all are alive today. So I believe He alone deserves the glory. So the name Lady Pizzo uh, is a hustle name in this country. To admit, is a hustle name in this country. We know what Lady Pizzo uh, was actually involved with in time past, and Lady Pizzo said to herself, "This is not my place. This is not where I belong. I need to take another trend to a positive direction." So, can you basically explain to the public? You have people viewing you on Super TV Live. You have people listening to you on Super FM. What can you say to the public? Who Lady Pizzo is? Who she were? And now, uh, what is the stand now Lady Pizzo is taking? To make her life better. Oh, thank you so much, Brother Rufus, for this great interview. I bless God for you, and I pray that God increase you and bless your family. Amen. Yes, well, little piece of is a child. I'm a servant of God. I was, I'm a child who God sent to declare His undiluted and His grafted word. And from the time I was kid, coming up, the enemy saw my star, the star, the talent that God has invested in me, and he began to trace it. But bringing in the bad feelings, taking me among bad friends, making me to be influenced by bad people. And I was poor dead. Yes. I uh, lived in the ghetto for three years. I was intoxicated by a boyfriend of mine we were having in the past. Because after I thought that life had failed me, imagine a child with gifts. I would go in the street, I ministered, and my talent were used. I was sinking and people were enjoying my talent to my gift. People were getting the investment of God. Can you imagine? I would go out and minister and God will use my ministration and bless the heart of his people. And actually they were blessing me. People took their sustenances, their money, their values and they gave it to me. But after we have through with all of the program, I will enjoy them. Yes, because others that were there were looking at my habit. The people I were the more at that time, and I was my gave with youngs for a little or nothing, but never deter. I left there until God, by God's power, God was able to use a brother from America who actually came up with a foundation called the LBS Record Foundation. And his name is Bester Richardson. He's and he lived in America, he's one of the Marines, and by the power of God, he himself was in Liberia and he saw the suffering, he saw how people in the street, how people call us Zokos, saying no. He said, Well, who are those people they are calling Zokos? And he tried to help those people. And they went for addiction. They were doing a ghetto addiction where they go, when you can sink, when you can rap, you will come out and prove your talent. And by the grace of God, I were among those who talent were proven. And after that day, my free star with the son that say, You're leaving, Baba Bele people. God was able to intervene. He passed through that cell. And the sun penetrated the heart of great people. The sun went virus. It went around the world. And God, people were astonished. People wondered, But wow. And I can tell the world there are potential things in the ghetto. There are great things in the ghetto who the devil is manipulating. Great people, pastor. Minister, even presidents are there, but you know, destiny can be fighting, but it cannot be destroyed. Mm -hmm. I bless God for my life that He allowed me to discover because until you discover who you are, you cannot recover. So, I bless God for discovering my talent. And after then, when the organization came to me and I did a free time, they were able to talk me to the rehab. And I must say to the world and to all of my youths listening to me. Change just comes by the mind. Once the mind is made up, the house develop, and things of the mentality change. Yes, you got to make up your mind. There are a lot of churches I went to. There are a lot of great prophets that pray for me, but because at that time my mind was not made up, I was still there. But from the day I met up, my mind can you imagine a beautiful young girl like me. Look at how I'm looking now. I'm in a school. By the grace of God, I'm a high school student, and I'm attorney at the Mazanya Christian Academy at the 72nd Broad Street. Yeah, I am today a beautiful young girl. Let me in the past, my pride was abused. Men that were not keeping me 
Why would they use me for a certain time? Will beat on me, insult me, use all sorts of profane languages on me, but in such a condition, such a state. And that was how they took me to the rehab. I made three months. I was certificated. They gave me a certificate. I came out. And by the grace of God, when I came out, I told the people that I want to go to a trade school. Because even I will do the music, but I have to be equipped when it comes to the other side of life. And I went to the school they called GVI. It's located in Dupo Road, right at the warehouse. I went there. I made another more three months. I graduated with honor and with proud to the power of the God. Who are served and by the grace of God, yeah, I am today in studio. I'm coming out with my son, my own eyeball. Yeah, the son that you just took down is my first son on my eyeball. They call it see where he took me from. That one was done in my own vernacular. I'm a cool by travel for sign no Honestly, I suffer in the street. Yes, my story is too sorry for you know because from the background of form. I can't say poor because the Bible says life and death is in the power of our tongue. But it's a background that is determined. It's a background that before we even afford, it has to be God. And I believe that God sent me to this family to be their deliverer. To be a child that will turn things for their good. And I bless God so much for my life. By the grace of God, I'm in school. I can go to my friends and motivate them. I'm with my manager. Brother Smith and Numa, he's the one that God sent in my life. He been there for me. I stole his number in my phone. God sent. You know, sometimes my friend asks me who who got the number, and I tell them who the man is because it take a man who don't born a child. You know, in Liberia, other people bring discrimination. Mm -hmm. They say I not born in one that they want a born. But from the day God brought it in my life, He has been to all of my tough times. Sometimes I do things to hurt the feelings. But he know that everything that will happen, it will happen because of reason. So I pray that God will carry me. I want to tell the word that you all will believe that God can do it. Don't overlook yourself. Nothing comes easier. For Jesus to be great, for Jesus to be called a savior, he was persecuted. For her to be given a child, she was a barren woman. Everything that will be great will be tested. Because until you can be tested, there will be no testimony. So I bless God for my testimony. And I know that through my testimony, life will be transformed. Souls will be warm unto his glory. Life will be translated unto his kingdom. Thank you. God bless you. Well, well that's, that's made a piece of our work. Uh, actually, um, I'm one person who's going to uh, uh, get in motion. Uh, my, my emotional, emotional feelings is just at the finger tip. tip. So, so when you see me crying on this live video, video or this live interview, please bear with me because her story is a story uh, that is set to cause some level of transformation in the lives of our friends that are still in the ghetto. You listen to more, right? But let me play something from her newest effort. When I play the song, uh, then we will come in deep. To talk to, talk to her manager, manager. and uh, those things that, things that are to be done that, that will that take, take little pieces from, from one level, level to the to other. other. It's all about, about the collective the effort. effort. That's why I, I often love to, to uh, quote one of uh, Muhammad Gandhi's uh, writings, writings that states in our quotes: "The difference between what we do and what we are capable of doing will suffice to solve most of the world's problems." Unquote. So if we are capable of helping people and not to destroy them we must blend our ideas we have like minds like minded people who are looking in the direction of uh, humanity we can join them it shouldn't be just us if it's not us it shouldn't be others we can assess others who have begun this work give our little helping hand morally financially spiritually we can give them a helping help hand so that they move forward and turn things around for others who they are concentrating on to make better for the future. So we're so going to play Lady Pizzo song. Uh, this, uh, this song, I know, I know it's going to minister to you that are listening. listening. If you're in the ghetto, you find, you find yourself somewhere, somewhere that is not worth being. Just listen to the song. And if and you're it, relaxing wherever yeah. in your car, driving through the traffic, if you, you stuck up, up in the, the traffic, traffic, I want you to know the little piece that you heard back in the days is the same little piece who is now transformed for the better. This is her current effort.
So I mean, this song, this song, this song, this song. I'm gonna make this song my theme song yes. for uh, the gospel carol vine on a very serious note. I, 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 I seek, I seek your permission to actually make this song my my. <laughs> oh come on, l l let me get you to understand, oh, right? Um, uh, little piece of. I think we need to have the time on Sunday as well to be here, but we're going to look between there. On Friday, you will be here again. We're doing the time we're going to share because this is about getting you uh, prepared to do greater things. I'm going to tell you for free. There are others that are out there. That, let me just send this as a caveat to all of us. Those are our brothers and sisters that we see are referred to as Zogos out there. The talents that they do have in that them, they do have the only, they are in down with talent. They are in down with the only need, the only they need in every they environment, in every environment uh, to spark out those talents. Those talent. They only need they in every environment, environment to spark out those talents. Talent. And who can create who can an in environment? environment? We cannot look out to out government to do everything. Do everything. <laughs> In Liberia, if you want to, to move, oh, oh, government, government. This is not about government. We want to use this medium right now. If you're listening, to actually, we want to generate funds. We want to generate as much as we can to see Lady Pizzo doing more than what she's doing. We want to see it because, mind you, through Lady Pizzo, there are a lot of women, a lot of young women, Women no, in the ghetto, young men in the ghetto, in the ghetto, young men in the ghetto. Testimony because oh, they all been there before. Because you listen to our story before. You uh, listen to our story. Uh, 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 I mean, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm actually charged. I'm actually charged uh, this evening. Uh, but I'm going to give a little space to um, the manager to speak uh, on some of the issues. Actually, how he came in contact with Lady Pizzo and how oh, things yeah. have been with them and what are the channels to which people can be a blessing to this, this ministry of hers so we are privileged to have the manager in the studio chief tell us your name and of course um your interaction or how you got in contact with lady pizzo oh first of all i want to give my thanks and appreciation to the management of the steel for first of all allowing us to appear and for the record we came today you know the, we came yesterday we, you know, we didn't meet anyone, but just interacting with you today and you are able to give us this platform, we are very, very much grateful. Not many stations can do this. So, so first, I want to I say, you know, thank you to the Almighty God. Also, thank you, thank you to you, to you and, and the management. We want to, we want to, want to use, use this use it, uh, as a uh, way of uh, clarity. Our, our chief. chief patron of course the ceo, the CEO of, this of this institution, institution he's a of, fan of, of lady pizzo wow yeah, yeah. So, so 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 uh the authority, the authority and all of, and all of the, the leverage, leverage uh was given us to uh, uh give us access, access to do to what do she's what doing, she's doing now. so thank, thank thanks so much to the ceo of this institution thank you so much oh oh anyway my name is smith a youth advocate and also a manager. Uh, 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 manager of the LJ Bounds Mission School, okay. located, located on Joshua Island, Island. Uh, adjacent the MRC community. Uh, Lady Piso, you know, I start knowing her from know. her, her very teenage age, she that is, she was that in her little age. She was attending our school back then. Back then I think she was in elementary. And, okay. You know, she had a gift. And, you know, so, Sarita, Sarita, I stopped I, seeing her for a very long time. So, so I took I my took phone, my phone while 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 going, going through my phone. I saw, I saw you know, a popular video, video that went viral. viral. And I saw, I saw you know, she did her freestyle and all that stuff. Like, and people tried to get in contact with her, but no one knew her where about. So I went into the pools at the beginning. Tell people, people no, I, I, I can find her, her, her because 
her mother lived not too far from our institution. Okay. So I uh, was to send for her mother and ask her mother, I want to see her. And right there we started connection and she came in contact, contact with LBS, LBS record, record and I was serving as like the, the uncle, you know, in between there to make sure, sure that things go on well. well. And we, we sat down, we discussed everything, everything and we begin to move, move on. on. Now, let now, me just let me, uh, hit, uh, the, hit the, 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 the nail right on, right the, on head. the head. What is what your is plan your of plan action for this vessel? Yes, yes my, my, my plan, plan of action, action first, first of all, I want to see all of us as a young person. I want to see all, all of us too. Has too. So, so, if you notice, if you notice she has been all of the the public claim for a very long time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, uh, try to, try to reach her from Facebook, Facebook, on the internet, you know, to be able to focus on her learning. And by the way, she is in the 12th grade. She's a senior student oh, yeah. at Zion, Zion Christian Academy. She will be graduating this year. So uh, my first plan is for her to get out of high school. High school. Okay. And we and know, know who's been doing this, this you know, all alone, all alone and, and all of us as a young person, trying to support her, trying to go behind the scenes things. But things are going, you know, down to the contrary, 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 contrary because uh, there, so there was so much difficulty in all of the So she was stepping in on COVID-19, breaking, breaking out of the fabrics of our society and stuff like that. Good. So she came to me and said, why not I go in studio and do some songs so that we can, you know, check around and see how best I can do some videos so we can raise some phone for my education and all that stuff. I said, yeah, that's a good idea. And then we she went in the studio, she did two songs. And the first one is her left, left story, story where, where we should we should just play and stuff like so. so that's how, that's how we've been, been, you know, moving. moving I've been, I've been moving for years. years I know her mother, you know, the family. We all we are like one family. We've been together. She called me Dali, and I take her as my daughter. Uh, sometimes I take her home. I'm well, you know, my children, you know, my children, everyone in the world, everyone she go there. She's free to, you know, sit and eat and do anything in my house, and. So now and let's so now, let's go let's, to, let's to, go the to, major, to the major uh, meat of this uh, whole of this discussion. Thing. Now, now Lenny Pizzo Lenny has this talent, has this and there are a lot of talents talent that, that I have seen in her, in her. right? Yeah. And I know yeah. she's, she's done with a lot of talent. Yeah. So to tap so, into this talent, uh, you just a single individual. You have your own family. You have all of those uh, connections. Uh, so that you look after other people, uh, not uh, just only her, yeah. but, yeah. but uh, ways and means to which, which people, people can, can assist you in getting the vessel to do more than what she's doing. What are some of the ways and what are some of the means people can get to you to make Lady Pizzo the, the very great person that she is to be? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, people can get to us like like I told you, I'm a humanitarian run 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 organization. Yes, the on my hand. There's an organization, organization that is pretty on the social media. Uh, that my children, children like we were where you okay. follow. We were where you okay. follow with the the street kids. Uh, the street kids. Yeah. Yeah. Once, uh, once, once, uh, once, once, you know, selling the street and all that thing. COVID nineteen broke up. We have been having a program. I know my friend. My friend. We've been we've been feeding the kids always. So we have a. A million in which we raise from, and, and we can, can use that same channel because I'm I'm like the one that managing that program and also managing also. If anything come through that particular channel, it will be channel through her and whatsoever purpose that we need for will be you know giving, you know full you know, consideration. Giving, you, you, know, can full consideration. Of consideration. We, you can get a little piece of consideration. You can get a little piece of donating la bureau. Two mobile money when you are in la bureau. If you want to help her, like you want to do a few, you trying to shoot a video and you want to do a few, it's not easy. You need a lot of phone, you need a whole lot of things, transportation, all that stuff. Like. So you can get to our mobile money number. Our mobile money number is 088 123 8175. Again, Zero eight eight one two three is zero eight eight one two three eighty one eight one seven five seven five. So and zero eight eight one two three eight one seven five. Yeah, and you know where we have uh two orange. Two yeah, the orange, orange number. The orange is zero triple seven. So is zero seven 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 zero zero two five two five eight nine one eight nine one. So the the orange number is 
0777-025891. Yeah, and for our brothers and sisters that live in the diaspora that want to be a blessing to Lady Piso, mm -hmm. uh, you can, you know, uh, use your, we have a cash app. Okay. And the cash app, meaning for people that live in the United States. So the cash app is dollar sign. Uh -huh, dollar sign. I come oh. in, I come in. Let me get the dollar sign quickly. Okay. Um. Okay. The dollar sign. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Everything in in in, in lower case that is small letter. Yeah. Dollar sign. Mm -hmm. Fi macha. E E D. Macha. M Y C H I L D. Fima Cha L D. Fima Cha Labira. Labira L I B E R A. So let's go over this. Yeah. Uh, the cash app is dollar sign. Yeah. F E E D, M Y C H I L D L I B E R I A. That's the cash app. That's And cash for app. those of us in Liberia wanting to uh, give help a hand to. Uh, um, uh, Lady Pizzo can uh, actually message or send uh, their mobile money, um, send the cash to this or uh, to these numbers 0881238175. And for orange subscribers, 0777025891. Right? Yes. So the cash app is dollar sign. Feed F E E D M Y C H I L D L I B E R I A. Sure. So that's just for the connection. If you want to actually uh, be a blessing to Lady Pizzo, this is the medium you wish. You can send an orange money and you can send um, uh, to the Lone Star number. And Lady Pizzo uh, manager is actually there for the orange money and that of uh, the. Um, the 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 the, the Loon star. So whose name is this the same fee my child? No, for the orange for here? the orange and Loon star is my number is Smith K Numa. Oh Smith K, K Numa. Yes, that's oh, my okay, name. Smith. Smith K Numa. Oh, okay, okay. S M R T H N U G B A. Oh, okay. S so, mm -hmm. M R T H N U G B A. Oh. N U G B A. I'm oh. Smith. Okay, so we're gonna get this brief out, get the song of uh, Lily Pizzo, and be right back.
She's Lenny Pizzo. We've been touching our souls around here, man. Wow. And if you just join us, this is Super Drive Time and Super 9 to 5 on 5. My name is Rufus Divine Khan and the Irreplaceable D alongside Lily Pizzo. She's dropping the vibes. She needs your support, folks. Now, let it be so. Let me drop the song. Let me drop the song now, of course, and get more details from you because folks are, are actually following us. Uh, we have 30 <laughs> followers right now, and the number is still increasing. And people wanting to know the detail of uh, Lady Pizzo have all, 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 all also posted all of the information. Uh, the mobile money number for Lily Pizzo uh, is up on the screen. Uh, you get the both uh, uh, GSN companies, you also have the cash app. Is also post that you're gonna to get to her manager whenever you are doing the mobile morning uh, uh transaction smith right yes okay smith nomad so that's lady pizza for us lady pizza there are a lot more you are doing my cat a lot more i know you want to do but i want to know from you the issue about the lyrics that you put yeah. together yeah is it your own making or you copy it after people or so like which one the, 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 do, you, do you do you actually come up with your own song of course all of my songs that I'm you write made, your own song of course it was inspired to the power of god through me it was not edited by anybody yeah for me on the list i'm more inspirational singer yes okay yeah i do the writing by the power of god to my manager and help sometimes to write arrange songs. yeah to arrange some things but whenever i go to the studio sometimes what i will even write when I reach to the well, studio, it will be, different. yes, it will be different. So from the day they discovered oh, it, yeah, they just they start to allow girls sing through me. Like for that, watching some just have that kind of free flow. Yeah, what God wants is what come out. This what come out. He himself bring his song. Okay. Yeah. Like for that, my praise. I was in my room one time sleeping, and I woke up. I was just inspired, and I decided to go to studio to tell the people the place God took me from. Because there are other who dare to feel that they cannot be taken from there. Some of them, they are alive. You know, they just feel that. All is lost. All is lost. Yeah, like one of my friends, one time she looked at me, she said, Nana, my whole level, I just to eat, sit here and look for my money. You know, back in the days, we used to go on the street. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine somebody you don't know from anywhere? What are that ghost? What are your people come from in this world? You don't know all you know, you want to get your living. But, you know, I bless God so much for turning it for my good. And I know the God who do it for me can do it for others. Okay. All you need to do is to confide in yourself and to believe that God can do it. She's Lele Pizzo. Lele Pizzo is in the studio. So you can put in your course. If you're listening to Super FM or following us via uh, Super TV Live, 0770-955-955 is the local line. 0770 nine five five nine five five is the local line you can call and talk to lady pizzo if you have any means of helping lady pizzo you can dash it out on us the website line let's get to the color hey please the volume of the radio what's your name and you join us somewhere my brother let's hear you lady pizza is in the studio yeah lady pizzo hello my contact lady pizzo and what I call for is you gotta take the lead, you know. Sometimes you don't meet your man, people will spend a lot of money on you with all properly. Or sometimes you meet your man as an individual, as a person, or can seek out your dream. Oh, so I just want to get a little piece of thank you. And let you also go to the ghetto, encourage some of our friends there to come out. Thank you for the show. And this is not, 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 not ghetto, I understand my brother. Going to the ghetto, she's not just going there just like that you know it is a ministry by itself of course so people must see that transformation in her when piso step out there her appearance and lose but if piso can change back and john piso and, and make that scene change and you know so what you need our support morally financially spiritually 
Okay, my brother. Thank you so much. 0770 955 is the local line to call and uh, actually form part of the broadcast this evening. It's Super Drive Time. We have in as our guest, Lily Pizzo. Of course, you, the song you got in the background is done by her. And uh, we are pushing that she do more than what she's doing right now. She came from the ghetto. You listen to her story. A story of transformation. To keep Lily Pizzo doing what she's doing now. It actually, it actually calls, calls for a lot of sacrifices. It calls for financial, financial backing. Yeah. And you know, like, so, yeah. like I always told people, you cannot go to the store and say shaklabo, shaklabo. You speak, you speak into uh, there. The male get the the the. the, the. <laughs> <laughs> you can't go to the studio and say, uh, brother, the Lord led me to your studio to to, to do a song, shaklabo. Let me do so so. He <laughs> said. And at the end of the day, they may give you a, a, a studio um, to do your song. No. She needs finances to sustain herself. She needs finances to go to the studio. She needs finances to do a lot of things. You, 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 you can help her morally. Now she's in school. She's in, she's the, in the 12th grade. grade. And she's about to write the whites. Come to think about it. She needs a lot of things to Let keep many piece of being busy. To keep on doing those positive things, it calls for your, your support. I know in Liberia, when you're not involved with politics or you think, I will say, for people to really support your initiative, come on, yeah. But I know this one. I trust the people who follow Super, the people who follow the entire Spoon group of company. You are cheerful gamers. I know you people can do it for little pizza. Amen. So let's go to the line. Hello? Yes, hello. Your name and join us from where? Okay, let's hear you. Yes, I want to tell you, ladies, I care in the studio, Lady Piso. Yeah, thank you for the music. That could be what to go up more. Amen. God bless you. Okay, Baba. Yeah, because we are very get out here according to our testimony here in our music also. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you. Okay, Baba. Yeah, she keep moving. That could be well. Um, yeah, thank you, thank you so much. The moral support, that is moral support he's given. So we're looking at financial support as well. And we're looking in other directions, spiritual support. And you know, all the support we need it. 0770-955-955. And we've been in the diaspora. And uh, you want to do that. A lot of people who just want to just go in the open. And when they want to be a blessing to somebody. Because, and, you know, they say, oh, I, I know. You love to do that in secret. So if you are... In that category, you want to do your thing secret. We have the cash app posted on the the the, 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 the page here. All you need to do is just cash app to um dollar sign F R E E D M Y C H I L D L I B R I A Feed F D E D M Y C H I L D L I B R I A. Feed my tribe Liberia. That's that's just for us overseas. If you hear in Liberia, you know how mobile money be no get play. Just cash cash up. You know I want to cash out there. Just mobile money. The next one thing you got for little piece on zero eight eight one two three. Add one seven five or zero triple seven zero two five eight nine one. The name that you will see on that mobile money is Smith Numba. Smith Numba. Smith. Now you see Smith and say the Numba there. Uh-huh. That little piece of money chart there. All right. So zero seven seven zero nine five five nine five five is the number to call locally to give your own contribution to talk about. Uh, those things that you want to see little people doing zero seven seven zero nine five five nine five five is the number to call and by way of information let me get the information up because um it is very important for all of us i want you to know as of tomorrow and this information i'm bringing this information to you through the concurrency of the best years and company in liberia and this information comes from uh uh, the I regulatory the body of GSN companies in Liberia, but let me get this color. Uh, please, the volume of your radio. What's your name? 
Uh, my name is Moses Neon, Yuma. Okay, Moses, where are you calling from? Yeah, I'm calling from Congo Town. Okay, Moses, let's hear you. I, 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 I just want to say, uh, may the present God bless you, Lord God. Let us know, let us know, let us let us know, let us let us know, 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 let us It is directly okay. from the LTA. Um, it's a release. The Liberia Telecommunications Authority, in consultation with the mobile network operators Lone Star Cell, MTN, and Orange Liberia, notified customers of a slight adjustment in telecommunications rates. Monrovia, Liberia, March 23, 2021. The Liberia Telecommunications Authority and the mobile network operators, Lone Star Cell, MTN, and Orange Liberia, have agreed to a minimum regulatory fee instead of a sore charge. You know, today is the last day for the sore charge. You know, we used to do our, when we do our little day for her, uh, the girls are gonna need a sore charge. So, Your dollar was for the that mini and something like that. So this is another thing here. Say the Liberia Telecommunication Authority and the mobile network operators, Lone Star Cell MTN and Orange Liberia, have agreed to a minimum regulatory fee instead of a sore charge. This amount or this minimum adjustment will be slightly affect will slightly affect voice and data bundles beginning april 1 tomorrow like april food day but this one are april food so let's get this information across to you all right uh, the minimum adjustment will slightly affect voice and data bundles beginning april 1 2021 we remain committed to providing affordable services to customers in a responsible regulatory environment now i will read this information again once more the library telecommunications authority in consultation with the mobile network operators like b that's lone star cell mtn and orange liberia notified customers of a slack adjustment in telecommunications rates <laughs> in telecommunications rates The, the Liberia Liber Telecommunications Authority and the mobile networks operators, Lone Star Cell MTN and Orange Liberia, have agreed to a minimum regulatory fee instead of a store charge. Minimum the minimum adjust adjustment will slightly affect voice and data bundles beginning April 1, 2021. Being We remain committed to providing affordable services to customers in a responsible regulatory environment. And this information is coming from the LTA and sanctioned by the two GSN companies and is brought to you live on Super TV and Super FM through the concurrency of Orange Liberia, Liberia best GSN company. You know, whenever there is a change in the communication setting, Orange is always pumped with the information so that you get to know that this is what the LTA says. This is what um, the LTA wants us to do. So the information is brought to you through the current currency of Orange Liberia. So we love to say hats off to you, uh, Chapo Maki, watching from Old Road. Thank you so much. Uh, Samra and Yuman, you're watching from Broadville City. When I'm from by, you also watching from my daddy. Oh, Bala G. Baka Yoko joining us from uh, JFK Hospital. Uh, rapper David Kwa uh, also joining us. Thank you so much. Uh, Mari uh, Chelwa Kawa Biago. Thank you, thank so, you so much, much for joining us. Uh, we appreciate your time with us. Okay, Lady, Lady Pizza also chip in. in. Uh, while she was actually waiting for uh, her <laughs> her interview, and Alison Weber is also joining us from Monrovia. So zero seven seven zero nine five five nine five five. With just ten minutes to go, 
You can put in your calls, talk to Lady Pizzo. She's here, and um, you can talk with her. All right? All right? Let's go to this line. Hello? Hello? Your name is Nijana Soma. This is Super Drive Time. I join you from Congo Town. My name is Mark Wilson. Okay, Mark Wilson. Let's hear you. Okay, I would like to say Kosti to, to my sis in studio, Piso. Maggie Bo. Let God continue to bless his prayer. Amen. May you reach the top. Amen. I was more thinking about you. Aye, aye. My little guy, I'm talking about that. I'm begging you, man. Zero seven seven zero nine five five nine five five. That's zero seven seven zero nine five five nine five five. The number to call. Uh, Chevy Garrett, thank you, thank so, you much. so much for joining us from uh, Tally. Okay, well, thank, you. thank you so Let's much. Get... Let's get to this line. <laughs> Hello, please. The volume. What's your name? Hey, and so what? Where you join us from? Uh, what's your name? Mohamed, let's hear you. Okay. 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 Thank you. Thank you, Mohamed. We appreciate you. Yeah? Yeah. All right. So let's get a play of uh, Fizzo now. Before we get Fizzo's song yeah, play, yeah. because we'll play this song continuously. Fizzo, yeah, yeah. the people been listening to the voice and you know with the instrument. Now it's time that they get to know the real Fizzo. Oh, and, you know, something for me, sir. Let the people feel you, man, Fizzo. All right, All right thank, thank you so much. Brother Rufus, for the great time. time. And I pray that I bless you more and more. Oh, we we'll do a song. Yeah, you know, this song is just it's one of the new songs for mine. For one of my favorite artists, Mercy from Nigeria. You know, I love the start of singing. Yeah, because you just believe in praising God. And this song that says, I serve a living God, even the day will know that truth. Even those that were manipulating me know that truth. That God is alive. This song goes like this. I want you to listen keenly and be blessed. Oh, Tenti Goro. Oh, na na na. Oh, Chero Tenti Goro. Oh, singing Panan Panan. Oh, Panan Panan. I serve a living God, even the devil know. Say Nan true. I serve a living God, everybody know. Say now nah, you the render. I serve a living God, or even the devil know. Say now nah, true. Oh, oh, oh. I serve a living God, everybody know. Say now nah, you the render. I serve a living God, oh. Oh, na na na, even the devil, oh. Yeah, na chu na chu na chu, oh, oh, the seven living God, oh, everybody know. Say na you the wind. How seven living God, oh, oh, eh, 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 oh, oh. Yeah, na chu na chu na chu, oh, 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 eh, everybody know. Say na you de re, she over na you de re ndo, she over na you de re ndo. For me it's too late to have a session on the back and I find nobody like you, Lord. Oh na you de re ndo, hey hey hey, all the glory and all and all belongs to no one else but you, but you. Which can add enough to us, bright the way that a few for all you have done, oh Papa, all for my sake, oh you came and you died, oh you wish again, oh Papa, all for my, all for my sake, all for my sake, you came and you died, came and you died, you wish again, you wish again, oh Papa, oh Papa, call it your glory, and I know. I saw with the Lord, nobody if you cross, I'm with you. Take the glory, and I know. I saw with the Lord, oh, now you the rain, oh, thank you, now you the rain, oh. 
From the east to the west, I'm searching if I can find a body like you. Oh, oh, now you the window. Jesus, now you the window. Jesus, now you the window. Jesus, the soul, so to find nobody like nobody like no, nobody like you. Eh, pizza man, pizza, pizza. Your glory, no one to share them. Jehovah, anything you talk, you do. Um, you get the power to save and heal that believe. Um, Ozina, the angel to sing hallelujah. You know the lie, you know the fail, you know the carry my matter the play. See us a day, you come in your own. When I reach my train, now you know the delay from generation to generation, from Liberia to Jamaica. You know the carry lost, you know the carry lost. You be your chip, ho chip, ho chero chero, tenty garo chip. Oche, 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 Let go for the cruise song, my CEO. Yeah, yeah, the cruise song. Yeah, yeah, that's my old father. Yeah, Mr. Waters Paul. Yeah, he's one of the great men around the world. He loved the song so much, Stars. You know, he's my country, man. We all from the same side. The song said, Now I'm not most from trouble. Now I'm on the antipo. God, I'm not a combo. Oh, Sam Can <laughs> continue but this business is all time bound so we will cross over to her manager for his parting comment darling peters i know you are highly supportive this is the lady piso she came from the ghetto now she's making her way she needs the support darling peter and others the entire crew you know yourself you need to join hands and let us support lady piso you know rufus just don't go behind things and uh, because it is 
I go oh, behind yeah. things because I see the substance of that thing and I see vision and I see prospects. So I, I know, know you all are great people. You're going to make your own support. And so we'd love to say um, you, you, you can give all of your support. So let's cross over to Mr. Uh, Numba, Mr. Smith Numba for his parting comment. Chief, your yeah, artist, your daughter, okay. she, she has yeah, blown my mind already. My mind is blown up. Yes. Yeah, oh, <laughs> yes, yeah, for me. Yeah, for me, yeah, I'm not surprised because I know the little pieces don't have a bad day. No yeah, bad day on the little piece of paper. No bad day. <laughs> Everywhere the little piece of gold, she don't have a bad day. Even when we take over my church, she take over everything. So I'm, I'm not, not surprised. surprised. Even in your school, like today we were here this morning, we were calling her because there was chapel service. She take care of the chapel service. You know, uh, uh, in Liberia, one thing I noticed that we Liberia we are not supportive. We only wait when something happens. We pretend. Look, now let me say so. So female, she came from the ghetto. See you on left side. She short thing going to school. There is no female organization or any. You know, I don't know female organization that is coming in to help on our little piece. I've been on so many platforms. There is no one. But let's say not a mistake, you know, someone hit a little piece of a car or something happened in the world. You will see all the human rights organizations, the women this, the women that, they will come up saying that they are advocating. And I don't, I don't know. know. In Liberia, I know the women of Liberia. Well, let me make something clear. Yeah. Darling Peters, I will send you Lady Pizzo's song. She has her own song. I'm going to play it for you. Just listen. Let the, 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 the manager finish. The woman got her own song, man. Hey. Taco, go ahead. Yeah, you know, uh, we are not supportive. You know, there's a, a I'm a young man. You know, I don't have the the all the resources or this and about. I believe in empowering your fellow youth. So I'm asking our Liberian people, Lord, the commendation it cannot carry someone anywhere. Let's not pull him beyond this gear. Now little people leave school now and start passing the street. Start so doing evil thing, all that thing. People only come back and say, "Oh, that one there, how far she gone?" But who know her problem? Who are those in the background supporting her? So I am appealing to everyone, every every librarian that is listening to this show, both through the social media and through the radio, let us pull our hand beyond this girl. When when she when we lift her up, she can serve as ambassador to rescue the lost souls. Those, 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 those girls that are on the street, that are sent to the street, those girls that are in the, that, that, that are in the club there, there. Those, those girls that are lost hope, you know, they will, they will be, be able to, to come, you know, look, look at our left star and come and say, if the little piece can change, I can change. So I appeal to all our women organization, you please come and help the girl. You can come right as soon TV here, get in contact with. You know, anyone here they can get in contact with a little piece of I'm not so you know for me to just say okay, she won't pass through me. I just want her to be here, let her be educated and let her say I'm to take those street children, those people who they call our cause so good, they will do this about the youth all on the street so that she can serve as an example so that all youth that are passing all in there, they will know that people all there love them. So let us show love. So thank you once again for hosting her. I pray that this will not be the first This is not the 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 I mean, it's a continuous process. It's a continuous process. This is something that will see you love to see. He love to see great things happening. So we invest our time in doing what we can do uh, through the help of God. So let it be so. Yeah, oh, party, come in, let it be so. Oh, my that's what I want to say here today. I want to bless God for my CEO, my own, own CEO. Yeah, I love the song for this studio. God can bless anybody. Yes. Oh yes. Oh, yes. That's you know that's the real world indeed. God can bless anybody. You know the God we serve is not limited. Yeah, you take the inferiors from the interior to make them superior. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Oh man, oh my again. Let me hear that again. Let me hear again. No, that's the reality. He take the inferiors from the interior just to make them superior. Yeah, oh, God can do. <laughs> I got busy like yeah, you, man. Like yeah, I want to bless God for my CEO, Mr. Waterspoon. And I pray yeah, whatever he is, let God increase him, favor him, him, and give you desire. Yeah. And, and I, I want to say to you. all of you watching me, it's, it's not, not about, about watching me. It's, it's not, not about, about listening, listening to me on air. It is it's about, about helping me, breaking my dream to fulfillment. Because, because 
I must say this, it's not about boast. Honestly, Honestly. in reality, <laughs> reality speaking, I was sent by God. Uh -oh. There are a lot of things God has invested within me that has not been explored. Yes. yes. And I can show my people, my, my own Liberian people, this nation, nation Mama Liberia. Liberia. There are a lot, a lot of great things in this country. But you but know, you know, like sometimes before people help you, they look at your conditions, say, what will I have depression? What will I get? In fact, I'm, I'm, I'm a child. child. I want us to embrace that mentality because if you say it's not your child, Remember, it can be your child, but that other person child who is damaging in that place can be a harm to you. Yeah, like I was telling one of my sisters in my school, yeah, I said, like I, was telling one of my sister. I believe in God to change my story so that I can talk to my fellow so youth. Because Nana Labro, a <laughs> few years from now, if I will not fight it, seven o'clock when me, you also didn't grow more. Yeah, the meaning yeah. you say you general too. You're not easy, brother. They're getting it's tough every, every day. The criminal rate increasing. Young, young, young children. children. Can you imagine children at the age of 10, 12 are in the ghetto? Mm. In, in our, our condition, condition, not as I'm speaking. Small, small children, children with our breast. You go in the lab hey. before motors. Yes, yes and, and now I'm going to them, talking to them. As you said, Elder, they need evidence. If you will tell somebody, somebody God go. bless you, they should first of all see the blessings of oh, God, God in you. Oh, yeah? Yes, to be motivated that indeed. God is blessing this person. So I'm appealing to all of my Liberians, my thanks and strong supporter. I'm your humble servant, your star, Lady Piso. I have a park song for the gospel. I have a, a, a feelings to go for the lost. I'm appealing to you, let God test your heart to help bring my dream to pass. The rest is not to the swift, but in that endure to the end. Remember that this war, that destiny can be fighting but not destroy. That child who is in the ghetto, there is a reason about that child. The devil don't go after the useless brother. The devil go after the one that God carry. The one who go in belly with things. These are people that the enemy go after. But with God, as the scripture really say that it may tarry, but it must come to pass. So I believe the God that brought deliverance to me. I sat in the seat of the studio today and I pronounce that that God will intervene in the heart of the youth of this country. Nothing is difficult for God. The one of my son I got on my track. The son I said, Jehovah talk and do. Come and do do your work. Anyway, because I want God to do it. Can you imagine me and God so now I used to be in the ghetto like one of my friends again? We used to call put it in the tour. Put tour to eat chicken. My brother when I want to open your mouth to pray. Can you imagine the cocoa meal or tea boy? But when she opened your mouth to pray in the ghetto because I used to have devotion with all my sin, I always used to acknowledge God. So God saw that too and decided to just favor me. Because even though I was there, but I know I was supposed to go to church Sunday. I was leaving it, they're going to church. I was leaving it, they're going for choir practice. Until God saw me that I have a mind. Even though it was my habit, but it was not from the heart. Like Paul said, he said, I don't wish to be among them. Help me to deliver me. And through the power of God, Paul was delivered. So the heart God came and delivered me, you know. Ready when she prayed, people used to come from around the ghetto, they would be standing. Around the ghetto, they would be standing. To see her pray. And she's still there. Yes. So I want the people to help me. To Not only the Liberian people, our government. government. And I want to say this. I pray that, I pray that even my president will not listen to me, but I know that government officials are listening. God gave us President we are for a reason. I told people, President Weir is not just an ordinary president. God made him to be a leader so that he can help people who are potential, who are gifted because for his entire story, looking at the place my president come from. Looking at his autobiography, he loves star. You know, ready in suffer. You know, one time I watched, he said he filmed for him and saw him tapping color when he was small. And you know, looking at all that thing that he passed through, and today he's a president. I believe that he can do the same. He can help us. So I'm appealing to the library people to help me. I'm in studio, and the engineer I'm in studio that helping my son in all those things. That morning transportation, I'm a student. I pray that God will touch you to help me. And I can assure you that it will not go in vain. The mind is made up. The heart is developed. God bless you. That's a word that I chose from uh, all of the words. The mind is made up. And of course, you won't turn back. So the mobile money number to actually get the support of FISO, uh, 08823. 8175 or 0777-025891. And when you go to do the transaction, um, you will have the name 
Smith Numba. Smith Numba. If you're in a diaspora and wanting to wait in as well to help uh, Little Pizzo, the cash app is the dollar sign F E E D M Y C H I L D L I B E R I A. So it's Feed My Child Liberia. Well, thank, thank you, you so much. We say thanks to Christopher Sear Brad. Thank you so much, Darlene Peters. Thank, thank you, you to you, Chevy Garrett. Thank you so much, Trepwell Mackey. Thank you to uh, someone you mark, Panam Fomba, Obla G, Bio, Bakayoko. We say rapper David Kwa, Omari. Thank, thank you so much. And, um, I I yeah, and yeah. all of us who join us and uh, we did not get words from you but you play your listening and viewing role I love to leave you at always with these words you will be remembered for two things in this life the problem you will create and those problems that you will solve and also remember that you should take responsibility of two things in your life your fortune and that of your misfortune in life Because in union strong success is show. We've got above our rights to prove we over our prevail. With hearts and hands, our country cause defending. We meet the fall with valor and pretending. Like Mohammed Gandhi said in our court, the difference between what we do and what we are capable of doing will suffice to solve most of the world's problems. Unquote. We have Lady Pizzo in the studio alongside her manager, Mr. Smith Numba. We will continue to have Lady Pizzo here until we can see that maximum support so that she go out in the ghetto and win the loss at all costs. This is an episode song that is taking us home. Listen to it.